Welcome back to Kingdom Hearts, everybody! I know it's been boring thus far, but hopefully we can make it a little more exciting this episode. Don't count on it. My goal is to get through all the item quests today. So first things first, Kyrie was blocking this way last time, but today we can actually go into the cove. Hey! Hey Sora, our raft still needs a name. Let's see, how about High Wind? What would you call it? Uh, well, not the Excalibur. Let's see, what would I name my ship? Hmm, this is a tough one. Huh. <sighs> Probably should have thought about this a little bit before. Oh, well, I'll go with a classic. Let's see. Sweet. I like the SS Goofy. Me? Huh. Well, SS Goofy. Hey, how about the usual. Let's do it! You guys at it again? Alright, I'll be the judge. The usual rules apply. Take any route you want. First one to tag that tree and make it back here wins. If I win, uh, I'm captain. And if you win... I get to share the palpu with Kairi. Huh? <laughs> Deal? The winner gets to share a pow poo with Kyrie. <laughs> Wait a minute. Okay, on my count. Oh, Riku. Yeah, so first up, we get to race Riku. And, yeah, this race is really annoying. Because weird, dumb stuff like that can happen. And Riku sabotages you along the way by making planks fall. And the platforming stinks! Look at this! Look at this! I can't grab on there! Oh yeah, and if Riku wins, then your ships that you get in the game will forever be named the High Wind. This is ridiculous. The grabbing in this uh, game is terrible, and by that I mean it's pretty much non-existent. Riku's totally gonna win! Sora, don't climb the freaking tree! Every single playthrough I do of this, I'm like, alright, this time I'm actually going to get the ship named what I want. No, it never happens, because Riku's a cheating butt. <laughs> Man, now the score is 0 to 2. Alright, we're naming the raft High Wind. My face exactly, Sora. <sighs> What's that? Oh, the Palpu Fane? It was just a joke. You should have seen your face. How about another lap around the course? I'll pass. Are you upset or something? It was only a joke. I'm upset that you cheated and the platforming sucks. He didn't actually cheat, but, but that board falling out is just so annoying. Especially when you're on it. Alright, let's talk to Kyrie. See what items we need today. Today we collect provisions for our trip. Let's see, Sora, you're looking for one seagull egg, three mushrooms, two coconuts, three fish, and fill this up with drinking water, but not from the ocean. And we get the empty bottle. Bring back everything here. If you need help, just ask. Alright, well, first things first. Well, we'll just move a boulder get this mushroom. Now let's get the seagull egg, get us in the trees over here. <sighs> I 
A plus platforming. Sora will only grab on about like 10% of the time. Most platforms just can't be grabbed onto. And I'm beginning to wonder if the seagull egg is even in one of these trees. There are a lot of trees on this island. <sighs> I'm going somewhere better collision detection. Also, you can use this zip line if you want, but it's also pretty buggy. Also, this is one of the spots you can fill that up with fresh water. There's also the little lake in the first area. Riku's just like, I won the race, so I don't have to collect any food. You have to do it all. That's not very sportsmanlike. Alright. Oh, and the swimming in this is just phenomenal. Also, we can only pick up green coconuts for some reason. There we go, green coconut. For some reason, the brown ones we can't pick up. My biggest complaint is it's just so easy to fall off platforms without trying. Wow, I'm having terrible luck with the green coconuts. Oh, will you just give me a green one already? What's with all the brown coconut? There we go, at last. Also, there's a seagull egg up up on that tree. Wow, the camera stinks. Seagull egg, yay. Me and Titus, we are gonna do a little exploring today. You know, to the secret place at the base of that tree. There's gotta be something there, yeah? Uh, sure. Alright, let's get some- let's get the fish. Oh boy, there are two of them. Got the first fish. Second fish. There's the third one over there. Yay! We just need two mushrooms now. Bing, beating, bing, bing, beating, bing, bing, da 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 Well, let's go to the secret cave. And on my screen, I literally cannot see a thing. Uh, what the heck? I wonder where this door leads. Also, this, it is never explained. 
what the heck this door even is and why it is here. Like, it kind of is, but it, at the same time, kind of not. I believe there's a mushroom somewhere here. Oh, there definitely is a mushroom in here. There it is. Yep. Now here's a movie scene. Nice little cute backstory. <laughs> well, who's there? I've come to see the door to this world. Huh? This world has been connected. Well, what are you talking about? Tied to the darkness. Soon to be completely eclipsed. Well, whoever you are, stop freaking me out like this. Huh? Well, where did you come from? You do not yet know what lies beyond the door. So you're from another world. There is so very much to learn. You understand so little. Oh, yeah? Well, you'll see. I'm gonna get out and learn what's out there. A meaningless effort. One who knows nothing can understand nothing. And on that note, that weird creepy hooded guy just leaves and shows up for really no reason whatsoever and my tv is so freaking dark i can barely actually i really can't see at all hope i'm going the right way yay there we go the sad thing is i'm pretty sure my brightness is turned up as high as it can go well we still need the ever mushroom must be somewhere in the cove that I didn't explore. Where's that mushroom? Grab the frickin' ladder! Sora... Apparently Sora cannot grab onto anything if he's in the middle of a jump. That was the most beautiful zipline I have ever seen. Sora held on for all of .2 seconds! It's a new world record! The jumping in this is so bad. I feel bad that I've been ragging on this game, like, non-stop. It's actually quite fun. Ooh, yay, cave to the seashore, let's go. Okay, seriously, where is that last mushroom? <sighs> let's talk to Kyrie. This I'm making, making a necklace of falasa shells. In the old days, sailors always wore falasa shells. They were supposed to ensure a safe voyage. Hey, that was quick. Thanks, Sora. Let's see, what's still missing? One mushroom. Yes, I know. I just can't freaking find it. Where is it?
Oh, I feel stupid. Here you go. Thanks, Sora. I found something today, too. Here, it's yours. And we get a high potion. Tired? Want to call it a day? Yeah. All right, tomorrow's a big day. We should rest up. Okay, this is where the game actually starts getting, like, semi-exciting. <laughs> you know, Riku has changed. What do you mean? Well... Hmm. You okay? Sora! Let's take the raft and go! Just the two of us! Huh? <laughs> Just kidding! What's gotten into you? You're the one that's changed, Kairi. Maybe. You know, I was a little afraid at first. But now I'm ready! No matter where I go or what I see, I know I can always come back here. Right? Yeah, of course! That's good. Sora, don't ever change. Huh? I just can't wait. Once we set sail, it'll be great. Donald? Sorry to rush off without saying goodbye, but there's big trouble brewing. Not sure why, but the stars have been blinking out one by one, and that means disaster can't be far behind. I hate to leave you all, but I gotta go check into it. There's someone with a key, the key to our survival, so I need you and Goofy to find him and stick with him. Got it? We need the key or we're doomed, so go to Traverse Town and find Leon. He'll point you in the right direction. P.S. Would you apologize to Minnie for me? Thanks, pal. Signed, Mickey. Oh dear, what could this mean? It means we'll just have to trust the king. Gorge, I sure hope he's alright. Thank you, both of you. And leave the castle completely defenseless. Of course. You be careful now, both of you. Oh, and to chronicle your travels, he will accompany you. Over here! Cricket's the name. Jiminy Cricket at your service. He who looks nothing like a cricket. Safe return. Please help the king. <laughs> That's goofy. Man, I forgot how many. Jiminy, your world disappeared too. It was terrible. We were scattered. And as far as I can see, I'm the only one who made it to this castle. Well, I mean, Jiminy, your world was kind of terrible to begin with. Oh, right. Well, I got gotcha. you. You mean while we're in other worlds, we can't let on where we're from, huh? We gotta protect the world border. Anna! Right, world order. <laughs> oh, I guess we'll need new duds when we get there, huh? Yeah, I forgot how many movie scenes were at the beginning of the game and how long they are. Look at this, this is still going. <laughs> and this is back before you can skip the movie scenes, you can just pause them. Also, that's the dopiest looking spaceship ever. Ho 
Ah, nothing says this is Disney like giant white gloves everywhere. What a charmer. Whoever made that must have had a goofy sense of humor. <laughs> well, that's enough about Donald and Goofy and Disney Town. And this is like the only glimpse of Sora's home life that we ever get. I just can't wait. Once we set sail, it'll be great. A storm? Oh no! The raft! Sora! Dinner's ready! Come on down! Sora? Also, the only mention of Sora's parents at all. They are literally never brought up again in, like, the entire franchise. And this music is epic. What's that? Riku's boat! And Kairi's! You remember these guys? They were from our awakening. Unfortunately, we can't hurt them at all right now. Oh my gosh, I cannot see at all. Please excuse me for a bit. Okay, I can finally see. But wow, everything looks terrible at this high brightness. The so first thing we're going to do is go to the secret cave. Which now has a giant door. Where did this door come from? Better go find Riku first. That'll hear what little HP we lost. Okay, even though my brightness is up, I can see everything so blurred together, it's like impossible to tell what's what. open. What? The door is open, Sora. Now we can go to the outside world. What are you talking about? We've got to find Kyrie. Kyrie's coming with us. Once we step through, we might not be able to come back. We may never see our parents again. There's no turning back. But this may be our only chance. We can't let fear stop us. I'm not afraid of the darkness. Riku? Riku, you might want to uh, move. You got a little dark spot right on your chest. This is where we get our main weapon! The Keyblade. 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 And I know as dopey as it looks to be attacking with a giant key, this is like the main weapon in the Kingdom Hearts franchise. And it actually is pretty cool in my opinion. And there's just an unlimited supply of these guys, so you can fight them to your heart's content if you want. Get to a really high level. I'm gonna level up for a little bit. Oh 
Oh no, you have to do eh. I'm out of there. Ooh, free potion. Yes, please. Why can't there someone else? Alright, now we'll go explore the doorway. Who put that door there? That's also never explained. That happened? Ugh. And now the islands are destroyed. Whoa. And it's time for a rematch of Darkseid. This time we actually have to win, though. Huh. But this time we have the Keyblade, so I mean... It at least is not as dopey as the shield, am I right? Also, later on in the game we get an ability that lets us see enemy HP, so then we'll actually be able to see how close we are to defeating them. Aerial combos are the best! Honestly, Dark Side is really easy. His attacks are so slow. Just keep hitting, just keep hitting. Hey, come on! I don't have all day, dude! Ow. There we go. We've already gotten quite a few level ups. This is Wunderbar. And we get sucked into the black hole of death, and we die. End of series. Nah, I'm just kidding. Now, for some reason that is really never explained, we get teleported to a brand new world. Doesn't really make sense. And now Donald and Goofy are dressed in weird outfits. Look, a star is going out. Welcome to Travers Town. Home of lots of Final Fantasy characters. Well, you know, maybe we ought to go find Leon. Oh, Donald, uh, you know, I bet you that the... Uh... What do I know? Come on, Pluto! Pluto's smarter than either of them. He finds the key right away. Oh. Uh. Huh? 
what a dream. Ah! This isn't a dream. Oh, where am I? Oh, boy. You're in Traverse Town, Sora. Didn't you read the opening title card? Do you know where we are? This is totally weird. I'm in another world! Just like you always wanted. Let's start by going in the accessory shop. Oh, hey there, how can I... Ah, it's only a kid. I'm not a kid, and the name's Sora. Okay, okay, simmer down. Why the long face, Sora? You lost or something? No. Well, maybe. Where are we? Huh? Traverse Town. So, Gramps, is this really another world? Don't call me Gramps. The name's Sid. Anyway, not sure what you're talking about, but this ain't your island. Hmm, guess I'd better start looking for Riku and Kairi. Well, good luck with whatever it is you're doing. If you ever run into trouble, you come to me. I'll look out for you. That's very nice of you, Sid. Thanks. And we're going to save and leave the episode off there. Thanks for watching, I'm Color Forty, and tune in for the next episode. Things are going to get even more exciting. Have a great day, and God bless.